Yo, what is, what is up, guys? Welcome back to Mega Man Battle Number 2. Last time, we fought Proto Man one more time. We got his chip, and I just kind of made a little update video that uh, we kind of changed some audio and some uh, some video things. So, let's continue on here. We're getting back onto the airplane. We had a pretty great trip, though. It was pretty rough, but at least it was memorable. Goodbye for now, Netopia. I'm sad to leave, but I'm sure I'll be back someday. The plane will be landing in Electopia soon. I was only gone for a little while, really, but somehow it feels like it's been years. I wonder what everybody's been doing. I can't wait to see everyone again. Doom, 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 doom. Dex! There, we were waiting for you to get back. All we heard about your adventures in Electopia. We all heard about your adventures. What's wrong with you? Yeah, Melu. I thought you'd be happiest to see Len back. Welcome back, Lan. Hey! Why the glum look, Melu? She's been worried sick about you, you big dummy. I was so worried, Lan. Hey, not, not so close. Dex and everyone's watching. Hey! Ooh! Look at the two loud birds. I'm never letting you go away again, Lan. Melu? Bro's having, like, some kind of time. This is your captain speaking. Oh, he was dreaming. Dude had a wet dream. Our flight is currently unscheduled. We've crossed the international date line, which means we'll be arriving at Density Airport at 7.45 a.m. today. I hope you enjoy the rain every flight. Oh, Melu. I am your captain speak... Huh? Uh, uh, uh? Where, where am I? In the airplane. Where else, sleepyhead? You were, uh... You were talking in your sleep, land. <laughs> Melu, oh Melu! I can't wait to tell everyone. Hey, I didn't say anything, okay? So don't you dare. Just kidding. You awake yet? Yeah, I think. What? What time is it anyway? 11:30 a.m. It's almost time for lunch. Hey, Lan, let's ask if we can see the cockpit. I'm not sure they'll just let us in like that. Sure they will. We just have to ask them really nicely. Sure. Why not? We we can tell everyone later. All right, we're on the plane. I love the little sprite for the old lady, like with her legs bent in. She's like crouching on the chairs. So funny. Airplanes sure can fly high. I didn't sit by a window last time, so I couldn't tell. <clears throat> He's asleep. I should just let him sleep. Hey, here's that kid again. Still not talking. Has he got a? He's got his PET open or something. I can't wait to get to Electopia Sushi Samurai Geisha. I'm a big fan of airplanes. I've always dreamed about riding planes. This type of plane can only carry a few people, but it's very comfortable. I heard this plane has some kind of special program. Special program, you say? Oh, very kind of you to speak to me. Here is for you. It's nice to traveling with companion. That's what you get for talking to people. See, that's what I like about this game, too, because there's, like, so many secrets. Like, unless you talk to that dude when you get up, you would never get that chip. Even though it's, like, not really a useful chip or anything, it's just, like, a little thing. It's just a little thing that you would, like, there's so much of that junk. It's pretty outside. I want to see outside, too. My dad was supposed to sit here, but he, he got a stomach ache and went to the hospital. Bro went to the hospital and left his kids on the plane alone? Yeah, my, my stomach uh, it hurts. Ugh. The girls over there are my sisters. They're twins. Oh my god. Bro actually just left his kids. Holy. Uh, it's got a jack in even though it's old. Let's do it. Let's see what this plane's all about. Got a bug frag. Sick, sick. I saw some sub chips. Yep, 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 yep. Um, what should we get? I can't see the quantities of what we have there, but I don't care about sneak runs. I would more so rather spend my money on unlockers. So, nor here nor there. Do we actually have 380 HP? That's actually, like, not... That's not all that. That's not all that. We're actually getting there, man. Not bad, not bad. That's pretty, that's pretty good for this point, I, I'd say. Not bad. Ugh. Bro, I love all of the scenarios in this game, and we're also having like one of the parts with uh, some of the best music coming up in the game. Freaking love this music that's about to come up, man. Is there another blue mystery data in here? Maybe not, because that one was in the center. I think that might be the only one. Schmackler. 
Oh, let's see if we can get this guy. Yeah, there we go, there we go. Just kind of gotta get out of the way for the man to get him. Zoom! And nothing. Bro, I need to get some of these chips, man. I need to get some of these chips. Mm -hmm. A control panel for the air conditioner. You can't jack in. Let's see who's back there. It's a, labor uh, a lavatory, but I don't really need to use it right now. Where's that dude? There's dudes in here. It's the crew room. No one except the crew can enter. It's for storage. I can't open it. And I love that you can just like click on everything and it gives a description. An economy seat, but it still looks pretty comfortable. Like it just gives a description of everything. Like these games are so detailed, man. And I also love these old games because like everything that you can't see like this is behind the curtains and stuff. But it still shows it a little bit. Like as a kid, these games were perfect. Because like old games make you use your imagination to fill in the gaps. Bro, it's just brilliant. Something's lying by the curtain. Got an HP memory. It's a relatively new TV, but you can't jack in. So the other one's old and we can't, though. The magazines are placed here. And you can, like, see the magazines, like, in low pixel quality. But it's just... This game, I freaking love these old games, man. I'm going to Electopia to learn about networks. I wonder what kind of technology they use. It's been a long time since I've gone home to Electopia. I'm going to promote my dance style in Electopia. It'll be famous within six months. Sure thing. I'm going to a homestay at this boy's house. I'm going to study a lot there. Until yesterday, I was... Until... Hold on. Until yesterday, I was on a homestay at this boy's home. I mean a lot. I went to Net... I went to Netopia for a World Bug Symposium. Oops, shoot. Entomologists from the world over gathered there and discussed bugs non-stop. It was pretty interesting. Big lips. This is a business. Fewer seats than economy, huh? That's comfortable. But the flip side is that you pay more for economy. My trip to Netopia was a lot of fun. But what is it they say? There's no place like home. True that. I'm the famous president of the Gauss Incorporated. I'm taking a secret... I'm taking a secret Electopia vacation. Normally, I'd be riding first class. <laughs> what are you holding? What are you holding, dude? What is that? Is that his... Is that his PET? I can't tell. Oh, here we go in first class. The curtain's close, so you can't enter. First class, the curtains appear to be made from good materials. Can't tell by looking at it, but this is the newest TV. It's designed so you can't jack in. It's designed so that you can't? What the flip? I love traveling. I used to travel around the world with my grandfather, but now I travel all alone. I have money, but that doesn't buy happiness. Glad somebody realizes that. These flowers aren't fake. They're the real article. Damn, real flowers on a real plane. Ow. A woman's magazine fashion trends are plainly stated. Apparently this autumn's color is black. You can only imagine how much a bottle of this would be. No oh, flipping kidding, dude. What is this dude doing? A music magazine explaining the latest music scene. Looks like a potent bottle of whiskey? Bro, this is a kid's game. That's probably where all the whiskey went from the shop back at the airport. The smell of uh, sweet fragrance. What an amazing chair. This very definition of gorgeous. Oh yeah, first class, baby. Feels so good, cause you know, I'm number one, baby. Know what I'm saying? Knows what I'm saying? The pilot's cap, it's big. Almost too big. What's up, cap? Excuse me, but would it be uh, possible to see the cockpit? Yeah, sure thing, kid. Well, this is cool. What an awesome view you guys have. Pretty cool, huh? I saw a cockpit once when I was a kid. You saw what when you were a kid? And that's what made me choose to become a pilot. Uh, yeah, I bet it was. Well, it's like your dream come true. Oh. Uh, looks like we hit an air pocket. You better go sit back down. Uh, yes, sir. Thanks for letting me up here. Come on, Lan. Let's get back to our seats. Your attention, please. We apologize for the bumpy ride, but it looks like we're through the worst of it. The captain has turned off the seatbelt sign. Looks like the turbulence is over. It's almost time for lunch. Want to walk around first? Yeah, sure. And here's the brilliant thing. I know that you guys might be bored of this, but literally, the next scenario, when it like blacks out like that, we can literally start talking to people again. 
and they say different things like this game is it's got so much like crammed into it dude like new dialogue and stuff i freaking love playing these games like over and over again and always getting a new experience it's so good that was quite the heart shaking what a surprise i thought i'd have a cataract arrest uh yeah sure man just a little turbulence i wasn't scared at all no problem oh my goodness when will we land in Utopia? <laughs> More dots. Bro's just hot chilling. It's like, don't talk to me. I don't like this at all. All right, we're going to run through. Let's talk to some of these people again. See what they have to say. We're getting updates here. What, what, what happened? What's all the, uh, the fuss about? Mm, you woke me up. Keep yourself calm. All right, talk to you. What's the kids got to say? Everything shook. I was so scared. <laughs> I was so scared, but I won't cry. That, that was scary. I, I, I think I wet myself a little. <laughs> oh, God. I mean, I look at it, but I'm a doctor. Natopians call me Dr. Iron Fist. Oh, well, God, he's an OB. An Iron Fist doc. Pretty cool, huh? You don't believe me, do you? Okay, how about this? Oh, Lord. I always give this to young pe Oh, God. Okay, we're done here. We're done here. I research programs for artificial personalities, like the Navi. Electopia's Navi are fam or world famous. I'm looking forward to seeing them. That guy, that guy, you, you need to sit somewhere else, little girl. And one, two, and one, two, and one, two. I just can't wait to start dancing in Electopia. And one, two, three, spin. It's my first time, it's my first time leaving Netopia. It's exciting. Going around is full of surprises, common sense in one country's absurdity in another. It's an education. True that. A lot of people could experience a lot of stuff from traveling. When I get home, I'm taking a nice bath. Then I'll clean my house and clothes. Why does that actually sound like not bad? Why am I so old? Taking a bath, cleaning cleaning the house? Yeah, I'm so old. I actually vibe with that so hard. <laughs> I'm glad I paid extra for this seat in business. It's so comfortable. Hey, kid. Did you know that this plane has a one-of-a-kind high-power program? <laughs> what? Flipping so sketchy ass, man. What are you on about, old man? That turbulence. Speaking of which, the guy in front of me keeps moving around. What's his problem? Uh, let's see what we got. Oh, you want some whiskey, dude? Oh, that's so nice. I want to fly first class, too. But the Electopian Bug Society doesn't have much money. Land, it's almost 12. Time for lunch. Guess I'll get back to my seat. I didn't even get to talk to the other guy. No, no more. Oh, I'm totally stuffed. Well, Land, you must have really been hungry. This plane's food is a lot better than I expected. Ten minutes later. Oh, what's wrong, Land? Oh, my stomach. Oh, my stomach hurts. Serves you right for pigging out. I also need, like, not pig like pig out pigging out i need to not say that like into the mic i need to like talk up here a little bit that was quite a heart shaking what a surprise i thought i'd have a cataract arrest okay so we're we're good here um at this point nobody's saying anything different so let's go to the what laboratory here we go let's go take a sh i was helping this man with his luggage and uh, a big spider what kind of a spider where did it go it was all black and hairy with fat legs and red eyes. It went running off, but it's probably no big deal. Uh, I'm not so sure about that. Excuse me? Wait, wait a second. Didn't that guy from before say that he was taking something poisonous on the plane? Hmm. Is it okay to put this on board? It's got uh, poison. What if it escapes midway through? But the flight's about to leave, yeah. Oh, God. I hope that he doesn't come on our flight, psychopath. Did you hear them just now? A spider covered with black hair. What if it's poisonous? Exactly. That would be bad. Real bad. Maybe one of the passengers knows about bugs. Hmm. Someone who knows about bugs. See, and this is the key. If you take your time, you talk to people, you'll like figure all this out, like know who's who. The food's good. See, and then they start freaking new dialogue, dude. We're in an airplane. Like this, this scenario could go by so fast. But like when you just take your time and talk to people, this game's freaking so filled with content, man. We're getting close to Electopia now. Oh, Electopian food, noodles, tempura. I'll eat it all. Bro's still dotting it up, man. 
I hearing a Lectopia very beautiful. I'm so excited. Oh, I guess I didn't get enough sleep. I'm so tired from my business trip. The in flight meals are great here. I ate too much. I'm trying to like keep everybody's voices accurate. I can see outside. Changed my seat because she asked. Aren't I great? Aw, oh, cute little twins. I'm so bored. Yeah, you and me alike, homie. I'm trying to come up with new steps for Electopia. See? I'll do a turn and a one, two, three. I like that. I hear Electopia and Navi are top notch. There's this blue one. Um, Mega something. I really want to see that one. Well, you're in luck. <laughs> you're in luck. I should read up on the data on my patients. I want my mom's food. My ears hurt. I guess it's from the ear pressure. You know, I gotta work tomorrow. It's like such a drag. I should quit. <laughs> <laughs> the meals in business are great. I overrate. And now I'm too full. <laughs> Dude, freaking. Ah, oh, you're so gross. Where's your manners, man? Don't just wander around the airplane. It's dangerous. You never know what might happen while we're in flight. Oh, this guy does not give me confidence. Oh, I'll tell you that right now. Hey, Sonny, you going to Electopia? I love Electopia. Go there every year. Thinking of building a second home there, I am. Are you flipping Yoda? Building a second home there, I am. This is the bomb, yo. It's too quick. Is what? It's too. Is that what he means to say? It's too quick. Qu quit. Quit. I need some tombs with rhythm up in this mother. What? Yo, up in this mother? Whoa, 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 whoa. What is this? He's implying some words, man. <laughs> I actually don't remember that he says that. We can leave things up to the program, so nights are relaxing. All systems performing satisfactorily. All right, let's go talk to the bug expert. Of course, as you notice, we talked to everybody except one person, and this would be Big Lips. Anything I can help you with, Sonny? Um, I'm looking for someone who knows about bugs. Knows about bugs? Well, don't insult me. I know so much about bugs. They call me the encyclopedia. Uh, well then, I was I was just wondering. Do you know any spiders with fat legs and black hair? Well, spiders aren't insects. But I but I know a few like that. Uh, did it have any other notable features? Um, oh yeah, it had really red eyes. Ah, that's an easy one. Lives in Natopia, that one. The red-eyed wooly spider. The red-eyed wooly spider? Yes, it's uh, quite rare, you see. Easily identified by its thick black hair and red eyes. And it's incredibly lethal poison. If a person is bitten, they freeze up in a few hours. Ah! What was that? Came from those seats in the back. Lant, what if... Magman, let's go. Right on. Thanks, mister. Uh, my pleasure, Sonny. If it's anything about bugs, I'm your man. Does anybody change their words? No, 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 no. Not yet, not yet. Let's see what's going on back here. Yeah, nobody's talking, nobody's talking. Oh, God. What happened? A, a spider, it bit. Ugh. Oh, no. What, what should I do? Magman, find out if any doctors are on this plane. Roger. Oh boy, oh boy, what should I do? Spider g got me. He got me. I heard a scream and something fall in the back of the plane. Maybe it was just my imagination taking flight. <laughs> That's such a Natopian joke. What a view. What a ride. This plane's great. I'm in heaven. I, I needed to like get his accent. Dude, st like you don't care, do you? I heard a scream in the back. Wonder what it was. Well, st stop it. Stop it. Somebody help her. Uh. Uh, oh, just a dream. I can't believe I'm dreaming about work. I must, I must be tired. That guy sure does talk in his sleep. He must be tired. I'm tired of seeing nothing but clouds. Play with me, no? My sister's starting whining. Be quiet, you two. I'm responsible for them right now. Obviously, we gotta go real quick and talk to everybody. What's this guy gotta say? What is it? I'm almost done with, a, with my new step. It's called Geisha Spark. Not bad, huh? I heard there's a kid called Chod who's an official net battle. He has an amazing busting techniques. I also want to see his Navi Proto Man. So there's the doctor. We all know that. Are we there yet? I just want to get back home. 
I yawned and then I my ears popped. I'm all better now. Amazing. Amazing. I like hate working right after trip. <laughs> I just heard a scream coming from an economy class, but it's nothing to do with business. Oh yeah, sure it's not. You look like you're a good with a navy kid. You know what? I am too. <laughs> Why are you so flipping creepy, man? You like calm your shoes. That guy was loud, but he's got a nice voice. He's got a nice voice, huh? Yo, 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 yo. Yo, yo, what's up? Mimsy diggity do in the house. In the house. Getting some freestyle up in this muzza. Yo, yo, yo. <laughs> uh, he's got some energy. Oh, I'm sleeping. What's wrong? Did something happen? All right, let's go talk to the doctor. Now that we did all that. See, so some of the dialogue is, it's not like rewarding, but it's just so cool that they like change the dialogue all the time, you know? An emergency with the patient by the lavatory. Got it. I need to get ready. So you go over there first. All right, let's go back to uh, the lavatory. Let's wait for this guy. I found a doctor. That should do the trick. Is he going to be all right, doctor? I think so, but he should rest until we reach Electopia. He appears in, to be in shock from the poison. He was bitten by a spider. A poisonous spider on the plane? Why didn't you tell us? Sorry, sir. You, you see, we didn't know that it was poisonous. Why the flip did you just bring a spider on the plane, whether or not? You should know. Why didn't you check? Well, no point in picking on the stewardess now. First things first, we've got to catch that spider. Except I have to look after this patient. Then I'll go catch the spider. You'll catch the spider? The poisonous spider? No problem. The bug guy can help me find him. Okay, you're on the job. And try to be discreet. If people find out, there's going to be mass panic. And panic means a lot of injury, so be careful. I'll be looking after the patient in the back. Good luck, kid. Right on. Alright, let's get going. Boy, boy, what should I do now? Alright, so everybody's kind of talking the same. Everybody's talking the same, so we're just going to go talk to the bug guy now. I'll tell you the truth, sir. What do you mean by the truth, boy? Such and such. What? A red-eyed woolly spider? Not so loud. Oh, sorry, sorry. Say, you want to catch it? Let's set a trap. Round up the materials to make a trap. What kind of trap will you set? It'll be a surprise. Here are the necessary materials. Some kind of box... Um, a stick and some string. Uh, and some whiskey. What? Why whiskey? These poisonous spiders like the smell of expensive whiskey. It smells, the fe it smells like the pheromones they emit for mating. Ah, I got you. Anyway, sure thing. That's why you want the whiskey. Ah. A box of sk a stick, string, and whiskey. Coming right up. Once you find everything, come see me again. It's up to you. All right, so let's see if I remember where all this stuff is. <laughs> the new dialogue started again. All right, so got a couple of things that we want to do here. First, let's go talk to these guys. Oh, I'm sleepy. Something happened. I could probably use his hat if I'm careful. Nobody should notice. Sorry, Captain. I'll bring it back. Got the pilot's cap. Here we go. Yo, kiss sub. Was that... You want some of this whiskey? You just out of the crib, kid. Go suck your mama's titties. What? You still up in my face? All right, kid. We'll see what's up. You want some of this? It ain't gonna be free. It don't come that easily. You gotta show me what you made of. I'm gonna sing a tune, dig? You join in. You can keep up with me. You'll get your sip on. Yo, we about to get some out. Oh, you ready to rumble? Hells yeah! All right, here I goes. One, two, one, two, three, yo, chicky chicky baby, maybe go kaboom. Can you dig it, lady? Oh my love, fire coming to you soon. Now this freestyle kid, right off the top of my head. All right, you got it. It's your turn now. One, two, one, two, three, yo. Chicky chicky baby, made me go kaboom. Can you dig it, baby? That what you made of? Oh, uh oh, it's it's lady. 
Here we go. I like how it's a freestyle and then he waits for us, but then we just repeat what he says. Can you dig it, lady? Oh, my love live fire. Is it love fire? Coming to you soon. Damn, boy. You got room. Here you go, kid. Oh, sh Yo, we got some whiskey. We about to get wasted. Listen to that muzzle. <laughs> Listen to that muzzle makes me kind of happy. I'm talking like him. That muzzle, that muzzle, that muzzle. F I know. I'll just call in sick. Did you know that there's only two seats in first class, so the service is top notch. But it's also insanely expensive. Man, I, I would love to try it. Gotta save up. Why would you want to spend extra money just just on that? Like literally, you, there's so much better things to spend money on. Almost time to work. To work? Oh, he's probably almost home, so he's got to go back to work. This seat's nice and comfy, but getting next to me is too far away to talk to. Man, there they go again, but no problem, I'll just yawn. Ugh. See, my ears are all better. I have a vision of Electopians doing the Geisha spark. I want to apply ne Electopian tech to Netopian nets. That sounds sick. Did you get it all? Give you the list of items again. Oh, so, yep, yep, yep. Sorry, sorry. All right, let's go get... So now we just need the string and a stick. Wow, I can see land. Cool, yay. Hey, let me look outside too. Wow, it's an island just like a map. Wow. You very, very wandering plane. Something problem? Ugh, so tired, but I can't sleep. Don't want to dream about my boss again. Ugh, help. Oh, no. Oh. Yeah, me, me too. Has anybody else ever had dreams like working and then like whatever you're you're doing for job? Like I used to work at Starbucks for my very first job being a barista. Who hasn't, I guess. And like I always like in the middle of the night, I would wake up in like a cold sweat and I would just be like making, I would find myself like sitting upright making drinks and stuff. That was freaking horrible, man. When you work so many hours that that's just like what is in your mind all the time. It sucks. What is it? Oh, these chopsticks? Well, actually, my husband made them. He and I have been making chopsticks for 45 years now. We have a dream. A dream of Martin Luther King? We want to take our chopsticks abroad and show the world how great they are. We scrimped and saved for the trip, but he passed away. We were always together. Damn. But then we had to break apart. Just like a pair of chopsticks. Damn! I was very sad when my husband died, but to keep our dream alive, I decided to go to Netopia alone. The Netopians loved my husband's chopsticks. I'm so happy. Damn! I'm sorry for rambling on and on. Would you like to hear the story of how we met? Oh, you're busy. I see. Too bad. Would you like some chopsticks? T take as many as you want. Damn! Sorry, old lady. See, this this is the cool thing, too, with the dialogue, though. When you, like, follow along with it for so long, then you kind of, like, get connected to, like, certain characters, even though they're not main characters. It's just, like, your imagination, like, filling in the blanks. It's so good. So good, man. I guess that the, the 720p in this game doesn't really matter either, because I'll just kind of upscale it, and because it's all pixels anyway, it, sh it, shouldn't, it shouldn't matter, man. We're good. I would prefer the 60 frames per second when playing this game and, and uploading it to YouTube anyway. So we have to get off when we land, I guess. <clears throat> I wish I could stay. I'll take lots of photos in Lectopia, especially at the center, with my cool camera. Oh, I forgot the camera. Dude's still just like, man. All right, so what's the last thing that we need? We need like string or something. You got some string? You need some rope or something? Um, Yeah, let me see, in, in my pocket maybe? Got it. Can you use this? It's just a thread. I just got a thread. You sewing, you sewing for somebody? Or, uh, did, uh, did he tear something when you, when you two were back in the, in the crew room? <laughs> you know what? I never pieced that together, but, uh, I'm just gonna roll with that, because they came out of the crew room together. Probably tore her skirt, and she just gave me a piece of the thread. Uh, that's where we're going with, man. Whoa, we got all our parts! Get the materials for the spider trap. 
already. Shall we set the trap? By the way, where's the spider anyway? Eee! Huh? The spider just ran in the first class! First class, we're off, son. Uh-oh. Well, people are starting to freak out a little bit. Alright, no new dialogue, let's go. The spider's totally gross. Yeah, yeah, she's the only one that changes dialogue, it looks like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, let's go. Everyone, there's a dangerous spider in our midst. We'll catch it, so just follow my lead and please move. What did he say? Are you serious? Oh my god. Now, all we have to do is wait for it. Look, it's here. Oh, hell no. Yo, that thing is flipping huge. Oh, hell no. Oh, oh. That's like as big as a hat. Now. Yes, we did it. Mission complete. Sorry for the scare, everyone. Thanks for your cooperation. Thank you, sir. Huh? This was a walk in the park. Ah, our first class. We trapped it. Let's go back to our seats. Sure, it's a long way home to Electopia. All goody goody. A few hours after capturing the poisonous spider. Attention, please. It's 5 a.m. The plane is on course and schedule. On schedule. Uh huh. Everyone, fasten your seatbelts. What? Land. The plane is shaking. It's not stopping. What's going on? Buckle up, Captain. Right wing engine. Red alert. Looks like a bug. The terminal is not accepting any data from here. Typo much? Accept me. Alert the net battler on board. Actually, he was bitten during the poison spider incident. Oh, Lord, help us. Ask if there are any other net battlers among the passengers. Are there any net battlers on board? If so, please come to the cockpit immediately. Did you hear that, Lamb? Something's up. Off to the cockpit. Right o Hello. Did something happen? Sometimes it gets a little rough in the air, but this isn't normal at all. I don't want to die. I want to get to Electopia. Dude's just, he's still chilling, unfazed. I swear, unfazed, man. That kid does not care. Buzz, quit shaking me like that. Am I still shaking? Oh, it's a dream. Oh, it's not a dream. Help. Oh, honey, I'll see you soon. Damn. That's so sad. Daddy, I'm scared. And these kids are without their dad? Listen up, you two. Hold on to your seatbelts. Trust your brother. Oh, what a good kid. Eee, oh my god! This isn't just engine trouble, what's going on? She should know. She's all about, like, uh, the net and stuff, right? Ugh, help! Someone help! Ugh. I'm scared, do something! Mommy! Like, what's going on? Eee. I help! Ah! I told you! You never know what can happen in a flight. Why? Oh, God. Was he the cause of this? Father God, please save us all. Yo, this dude's probably just hot chilling. Yo, 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 what's up? He is not hot chilling. He is not having fun. Don't you get something out of this? Or you get something out of it later when you land or something? What's happening? Ugh. All right. And something is now happening in flight. We're about to die. But we're going to see what exactly is the problem. Next time on Mega Man Battle Network 2. See you all later. Peace out. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye-bye. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do